It was rather loud at times this evening, especially for those of us along and north of the city of Charlottesville, primarily in Rutgersville and Standardsville, even up into Madison. We had hundreds of lightning strikes. However, if you were in downtown Charlottesville, you're like, David, what rain? Yeah, you may have heard the thunder, but no rain. That's because most of the rain passes to the north and also to the south, and that's where the rain is now. It's heading off to the north and also off to the east of us. There could be a lingering shower or two in the overnight hours, but I think the big thunder boomers are done. Temperature-wise, 79 right now in the city of Charlottesville, 78 in Lovingston, 79 in Dillowan and Louisa, 75 in Madison, 80 in Culpeper. But look at this. I've got no words. 77 degrees is the dew point. That is honestly the highest I have ever seen it here in the city of Charlottesville. That's easily into the ridiculous category. We may as well be set up sh shop on, along the Gulf Coast with how humid it is out there. And we'll remain on the super humid side out ahead of this cold front. This cold front, though, is eventually going to move on through as it does so. It really doesn't give us colder weather, but it does knock the humidity level down several steps on that monkey meter. So that's at least something to look forward to by the time we get into Saturday. But Friday, it's going to be on the humid and also the stormy side. Once again, yes, more showers and thunderstorms are in the forecast for your Friday. Let's time them out here on your future cast. Tomorrow morning, upper 60s, very close to 70. Friday afternoon, upper 80s to lower 90s. That'll be the fuel to spark off more showers and thunderstorms. Again, some of the thunderstorms could be on the strong to maybe severe side tomorrow afternoon. All of that is long gone then for your Saturday morning with temperatures still holding very close to 70. Saturday afternoon, like I said, the cold front not going to give us cooler weather, upper 80s to lower 90s Saturday afternoon, but it will knock the humidity levels back down into the mid to upper 60s, which is a lot more bearable as opposed to the mid to upper 70 degree dew points we're experiencing right now. Tonight, we'll only be able to drop to 72 in the city of Charlottesville, 71 in Crozet, 72 in Sandersville, 73 in Orange and Louisa. Friday afternoon, near 91 in the city of Charlottesville, 89 in Crozet, 90 in Lovingston, Sandersville, and Culpeper, 92 in Orange and Palmyra. Brown Subaru 7 day forecast here has 90 for your Saturday, 91 with a great deal of sunshine on Sunday. So the weekend not looking too bad. Monday, solar eclipse is happening. We'll only see a partial solar eclipse here locally. It goes from 1.15 until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. 2.41 is the time of 86% coverage of the sun. And we are forecasting a mix of sun and clouds. So we'll have to deal with some clouds moving through the sun and the solar eclipse. So be aware of that. And then Tuesday and Wednesday, better shower and thunderstorm chances as another significant cold front heads our direction, dropping temperatures back into the mid-80s by next Thursday. Dan? All right, David.